so let's come to the hacking part so you can see what i've beautifully drawn here like everybody everybody can tell that my design skills is not that great so now your phone is a client and there's always a technology that loads um everything you see on your device to it you know with html css and javascript so it is from there that you like place bet and do other stuff but there is something that you don't see but that thing is entirely big we call it the back end so the back end is where everything takes place the logic the everything so you can't actually know what is going on on the back end you might not even know the services they are using but this is what i've came up with so as even you want to hack um let's say bet ninja now and you don't know what the this um, back end is even made of you can't so now this is just what i've came up with so i assume that they will have a central service that you know you make um api calls to so what api calls just means is that you can just like send requests to that endpoint so and i assume that there's also a bet processor that processes every bet so that one is actually different so the reason why i thought this way is that you know there are sometimes that the site will be working properly but they won't be able to process bet at that moment. that means this service is is down that means this service is 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 like it is down and you can they can't access it it's until they fix the service that everything starts working properly again then i assume there's service for sign up again and so this central service like it what it just does it it connects to another service so this is what i want you to know by drawing this illustration is that all these side that you are seeing bet ninja bet power bet whatever bet big anything they work on another third party services that produce all these things for them because number one it is too expensive and it might be less secure to do something like that on their own and so they have to rely on a cheap as in cheap enough third party services like bet rather so i'm going to like go to google now and show you what bet rather is so that you can know when anybody tells you that they have a service that can hack this bet site you know that they are lying 100 percent because you are not hacking any site you are not hacking bet ninja you are not hacking um bet power your issue or your beef is with this bet rather and this bet rather they are one crazy complaint that doesn't joke with security so i'm going to put that up on, on google and i'm going to see whether anybody has successfully act this patch rather before in history so i hope you understand how i like do all these things up so i do so you might you might not because you are not a software developer so if you have like any software engineering job or software development job for me you can contact me via my mail in the description box so i'll be waiting for your call so thank you on that so let's move on so now we are back on google so now what we want to do now is we want to check whether our bet rather has been hacked before so let me just search down on google right away so has bet rather been hacked before so now let's check this i am aka one article so information is provided and moderated by the members of the community accuracy has not been Validated by Hacker One, you can see accuracy has not been validated by Hacker One, so I don't think they have like hacked this um bet trader before. I don't think it has been hacked before. So you can see these are not <laughs> these are not official sites. So assuming I saw it on something like this, these are an authoritative sites. You can see it's ranking at number one, Hacker One dot com. So assuming I saw it on something like that, then. I can assume that it has been hacked before. So now let me check BetRadar itself. So BetRadar. So this company belongs to a sports company called Sports Radar. I'm very sure if you use Bet Ninja very well. So when checking the stats, you will have seen the um, Sports Radar um, icon. So it is there in this um, in the statistic. So let's see what they do. So Spot Radar, Bet Radar, the premium partner for the betting industry. So, Bet Radar is a popular, is a brand of sports radar. So, let me see what else we have here. So, what else do you have? And this company they also offer um fraud extension services. So, 
what that means is that whenever anything or whenever any fraud start um yeah this is it fraud detention services so whenever anybody tries to fraud the system they have a service for that, that automatically the debt that someone wants to like fraud the service so whether you want to hack it or you want to do any manipulation they have a service for that so this site is pretty secure so if anybody is telling you that they have hacked that site or or on youtube i'm pretty sure you'll have you might have come across such videos even probably you, it might be that you were watching such videos that's when you were recommended this one so just know that you can hack this um, site and if someone is promising you that they can do that they just want to take your money 